Today, we are taking a look at all of the brand new Pokemon card products that have been announced for this year and deciding which ones you should buy in 2023. Hey heroes, hope you're all having an amazing day. I'm Roy Kayin, thank you so much for taking the time to check out my brand new video and happy new year. I hope you all had an amazing Christmas and new year and I thought we'd start the new year off by taking a look at all of the Pokemon card products that have been announced for this year and to decide which of these are the best and which are worth buying. So let's dive straight into the video starting with the Paldea Collections boxes which are being released this Friday, the 6th of January. So they are coming out very soon. And we have a box for Springatito, a box for Foy Coco, and a box for Quaxley. These are the new starter Pokemon in the Scarlet and Violet game. So there is a collection box for each starter Pokemon. And each box has two different versions. So one of them will come with a jumbo card of Miraidon, which is the legendary in Violet. And the other will come with a jumbo card featuring Coridon, which is the legendary Pokemon in Scarlet. That's the one. I think these are probably worth picking up. They are the first Pokemon card products of the year. They're going for $20 each and you get the Jumbo card and four booster packs. I'm not too sure which sets it comes with. I believe it might be Brilliant Stars and Silver Tempest, but there might be another set hidden in there. But I would say these are worth picking up if you can afford to. All right, moving on, we have Crown Zenith. So for those of you that don't know, this is the brand new Pokemon card set coming out at the end of January. It is the last Pokemon set in the Sword and Shield era. So Pokemon have gone all out for this set. There are so many different products being released for this set, it is insane. So we are going to start with the Elite Trainer box here. Firstly, the design looks amazing. Lucario is a fan favorite Pokemon for a lot of people and the design is just on point for the box. The Elite Trainer boxes are now at 50 pounds, but you do get 10 booster packs with them, I believe. But having said that, the Pokemon Center are selling an Elite Trainer Box Plus, which basically, uh, if we have a look here, comes with two additional packs, so it'll be 12 booster packs. Uh, you've also got this incredible looking Lucario V-Star promo card. Um, the card sleeves look amazing, like I love the design on them. And you also get the golden dice and the uh, golden Lucario coin over there. If I'm being honest, I would say if you're willing to spend £50 on the Elite Trainer Box anyway, I would probably spend the extra £15 for the Elite Trainer Box Plus, um, just because it's, it's more of a limited edition product. And I think if I was going to buy the Elite Trainer Box, um, I would just go for the Elite Trainer Box Plus. But again, that's completely your decision. Anyway, they look amazing. Let's go back to the rest of the Crown Zenith products. So. We then have the Regilecki and Regidrago V boxes, which are being released on January the 20th as well. In my opinion, I probably won't get the collection boxes just because I feel like compared to some of the other products that have been revealed, um, I think I'd prefer some of the other boxes which are coming out later in the year. Uh, but again, completely your decision. Alrighty guys, so next up we have the Crown Zenith Mini Tins which are coming out on February the 17th. So you can see there's quite a gap in between all of the Pokemon card products this year. In my opinion, I would probably skip the Mini Tins only because on the same day they are also releasing the Pikachu VMAX Special Collection Box and it looks amazing. So you get the Pikachu V promo card, the Pikachu V Max card, the Jumbo card, I believe five booster packs. So I would save my money in February for this collection box because that seems to be one of the best products coming out for Crown Zenith. We also have the Crown Zenith tins, uh, which are then coming out in March. We've got a Galarian Articuno tin, a Galarian Moltres tin, and a Galarian Zapdos tin. So I believe all three come with the promo cards of the Galarian birds. Uh, they come with five booster packs of Crown Zenith. Uh, I'm not too sure of the prices at this point. Um, I might pick up one. I'm not sure if I'm gonna pick up all three um, just because there's a lot of other products coming out. 
All right, so the next product to be released is the pin collection boxes, which feature Rillaboom, Cinderace, and Inteleon. If I'm being honest, I'm probably going to skip these because on the same day, on April the 14th, they are also releasing the Morpico V Union Playmat collection box, um, which looks pretty cool, if I'm being honest. It comes with five booster packs. Uh, it's got the four Union cards there, uh, and it also comes with a play map. So I would probably save your money for the more Pico V Union box there. Now we come to what is in my opinion, the best Crown Zenith Pokemon products that are coming out in the next few months. The Shiny Zacian and the Shiny Zamazenta collection boxes. Now these come with 11 booster packs, one promo card with the Shiny Zacian or Shiny Zamazenta, one Shiny figure and a Shiny pin. I mean, there is so much in these collection boxes. Shiny Zacian and Zamazenta are, in my opinion, two of the best looking shiny legendary Pokemon. So I feel like this is quite a premium product. Alrighty guys, there you have it. That is all of the Pokemon card products that have been revealed so far for this year. In my opinion, I would say that the Elite Trainer Box Plus and the Zacian and Zamazenta collection boxes are the two products you want to keep your eye on for Crown Zenith. Again, all of the other products are really cool and you might have a different opinion. So if you do want to go ahead and pick up one of the other products, then go ahead and do that. But I hope this video has been helpful in showing you all of the different products that are coming out over the next few months so you can decide and plan ahead uh, before the products actually come out. Alrighty guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video there. If you found the video helpful at all, make sure to hit the like button and I would love to know what you guys think of the new Pokemon products. So make sure to leave a comment down below letting me know if you're picking up any of them. If you want more content, you can click on one of these two videos up here. I hope you have an amazing day and I will see you in the next video.